there are multiple ways of talking about social emotional learning and even at the Department of Education, whether they are connected with the out of school time work or college and career readiness or the academic work that we're doing and how do we bring just within our agency those folks together to talk about this and how we're giving technical assistance to schools and districts across the state. How can we be more strategic and collaborative in doing that so that schools are hearing the same message from our agency that's gonna complement what they're hearing from their out of school time partners and from their community partners. Um, but I will tell you, having talked with lots and lots of teachers and administrators about this, they're very excited to do this work and are looking for opportunities to grow and to develop. Um, and so I think that connecting them with all of you in this room and, and with your expertise and making sure that our during the school day and out of the school day work is connected around social emotional learning uh, will only help the youth that we're serving. Um, I also think it's important to think about intentionality and focusing on the adults. That's how we talk about school improvement and how we focus. And when we talk with schools and districts about being really intentional about social emotional learning, we talk to them about making sure their staff have a common understanding of what they mean. And it doesn't mean that they have to use the competencies that we're defining, but that they're using something that has evidence behind it and that they're all coming to the table and gaining buy-in from their teachers and from their staff and from their families and from their communities so that the messages can be reinforced for the youth in all the different settings. So we are really excited to be here today and to learn from all of you. And um, yeah, thank you.